Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Sagittarius. Um, it is a general reading. That being said, it may or may not resonate with you. If it doesn't sound like it's your story, check your other placements. Your messages could be there. Let's begin. So, um, I have this person and they're looking to the past for a... Uh, they look to the past, but it's like they think of the future. This is about a, a, a vision for the future or a decision for the future. They're weighing up the consequences of going back um, and how it might affect their future, so to speak. Um, it is a direction that is desired to go. It's what they're wishing for. It's what they're hoping for. There's been a pause, a break, so you've been on a break from this person um, as they try to understand uh, something or understand the past or under, even to understand the path that they are on with you, you know. Um, they could be looking at signs, uh, specifically they could be being shown uh, signs even given information by the divine to help guide them in this decision that they are making. So this person uh, may even be uh, speaking uh, to the divine, uh, connecting uh, to a higher power in effect for answers. At the heart of this reading, it is uh, what this is about. You see, we have the Knight of Wisdom. So he has been looking to the past here, right? Um, seeking to understand, uh, seeking information. And he has found it. Look, he carries it in his book. So he comes forward um, with new wisdom and he has no weapon. So he's not coming forward to fight. He's coming forward to offer this new wisdom, this new plan, this new idea, whatever this is. And who does he come to? He comes towards the Queen of Wands. This would be you. And um, I feel like there's something they have to tell you. Something... Uh, Something that answers a mystery for you or unravels a mystery for you somehow. Something maybe you've been uh, puzzling over. There's, um, there's a, I feel a great love here um, between you or for you uh, from this person. They want um, a meeting. It's what they're coming. This person really wants to talk to you. They want a meeting. They want to meet up with this uh, wedding card here. It's it's a um, whatever they found the wisdom because of this card. We know it brings them joy and happiness and hope in some way that they can overcome the difficulties between you. And it is um, it is why. They are wanting this meeting, this reunion. They're hoping to uh, to kind of change the luck or that there's a change of luck now, that things can change. And here they are. See, there's the one they may have let get away, possibly. So they're coming back um, and they're coming to make a, a new offer, possibly to offer an apology possibly to express their feelings to you, um, but also to these two cards really strike me as something important. Um, they unravel a mystery. They have obtained some type of information in this pause, this break, or even an awakening, a realization that is... Uh, actually 
what has begun this process of uh, of change. Here they are. Here, well, here they were. This is the leads up to this, and this is the um, hanged man. So we see he is in uh, that pause. We had it here, um, thinking again about direction. Again, uh, these are being confirmed. So um, a second chance was on pause. It was on hold, suspended, while they figured things out. Uh, whether they decided to uh, fight for this relationship or not, okay? That was the question. Um, and whether to go back or whether... Um, whether you would even take them back. I mean, you know, depending on the circumstances here. The Seven of Wands is fighting for something, gaining ground. Maybe this is about whether or not that you guys could gain ground, that whether or not you could get over these difficulties. Um, we have also the Power card. Uh, in the King of Wands. So again, so now we're having a couple, the Queen and the King of Wands. Um, so this King, oh, okay, I get it. Okay, this King, he has uh, something on his conscience and it could be that something he did. Um, that's what they're saying here. There's something he did that he had, he has on his conscience that he would like to clear up with you. He may have done something when you weren't expecting it or said something. He he kind of took you by surprise, got you when your uh, guard was down. But, um, yep, yeah, that's what it is. And um, here they want to apologize. There's a... Uh, they're hoping with the information that they're going to offer you that unravels this mystery. They're hoping that you will be very understanding of why they did what they did. They're hoping for forgiveness. Um, they're looking at the cup. They're looking at the feelings. Um, and she knows how she feels. Okay, so maybe this is a question of um, they know how they feel, but they don't know how you feel. Okay, um, because I also have the king and I have this page. So the king is like an ever flow. Uh, it's like a emotions that never stop flowing. So somebody whoever's re being represented here by this king, they never stopped loving. The, the love, it, it's just, it was always, they never stopped loving you, even in the time apart, is uh, really what I want to say. But they're unsure about, somebody's unsure about how the other feels, and so they're not sure that they can rely on the plan working you know so um this is what they're weighing up what is the cost if i do this what might happen here in the future if i go back it is the desired direction it is what i'm hoping you know for it's what it's what i want if i go back will i get my wish and and that's the thing can we wipe the slate clean can we start again? Can we have that happy outcome? And, you know, to that question, um, this person is so emotional, so emotional, and they are trying to keep these emotions under control. This is a situation where they need to keep the emotions under control because they can easily escape uh, them. Also, they are very vulnerable, okay? Now, it has been, yeah, look at that, <laughs> eight of love, making up. They're, they're a little bit afraid here, I would think. Um, the road has been very long. Um, it's been very rough. But you see again this card, the passion for the desire 
in the color red and the color green draped over the shoulder says there's still hope so they're still hoping they're looking to the future and even though uh, the road has been rough behind look at the caravan that's way behind them okay even though that road has been a rough road there is still hope for the future and they're looking to the future with hope that they can with the magician manifest their desire Um, with the six of coins I feel like they've built a defense so they've gained their wisdom and they're building a defense before they return so th everything uh, that they want to tell you has been well thought out okay they just want this this painful period to end they just want to be happy they want to have their happily ever after and they feel that that happily ever after is with you they're hoping that you will hear them out they're hoping you will not hold a grudge and they are hoping uh, that you guys will be able to come to uh, an agreement um, to be able to work through these issues this person has something or to the issues that you did have in the past because you have the agreement card on what was written And so um, this person comes forth with something to offer. They're going to tell you that they mishandled something in the past. Um, it is possible, uh, if, if you're not careful, you might, with this card being reversed, uh, you could miss a communication or uh, maybe they, maybe you have tried to send them a communication and it was missed okay went unseen um, something went wrong they didn't get it I don't know but uh, it, there could have been a misunderstanding that caused a dispute there could have been uh, somebody was in a lot of conflict over messages or communication and that caused or is at the root of these issues and it seems to be some attached to some hidden emotions okay it's what needs to be worked through it's uh, what they're coming forward to discuss some type of communication issue problem or some community it has to do with communications that went wrong um somehow so they're looking to the past here this is all a reflection on the past for some big event that's coming up here in the future and it is a discussion with this person that's happening do you see them returning here with their cup filled with wishes hoping that that you guys will be able to manage to get onto the same floor at this meeting so in other words um, hoping that you guys that you feel the same about them or and about the issues or about the situation that is going to be discussed in order to close the distance between you because currently you're on 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 these separate floors and what they want is to come together they're missing information they're coming in they're going to be a little bit guarded uh, but they're not coming to fight the sword is down the sword is laid next to the chair okay um, because they're missing information but they're coming in um, a little a little afraid a little a little guarded but they're coming in to tell you how they feel and they're coming in to offer you some information that will unravel a mystery this is a very big event it can happen very quickly very suddenly now um, your overall messages here you are adored so there's passion and romance between you 
and a lover or between you and this person you love. It's like you both cannot stop thinking about each other. And that's quite apparent in the cards. You know, even though you're stumped by something they've done or uh, how they've reacted or or how they feel or whether or not you guys have a future, um, uh, this you guys still love each, each other. You are still always thinking about each other. There's a, a psychic connection. It's like you can feel this person. Um, for some of you, and this is not for everyone, but um, I drew two different cards for this. Uh, so for one group of you, you will have met this person uh, through work somehow or at the office. Uh, um, it, it's some type or a business deal, some type of uh, work, some type of a deal um, where you, you'd have met this person and it led to more or leads to more, okay? For others, you, you got involved with somebody who has a fear of commitment due to past experiences uh, that this person has had that, you know, have um, shaped how they think, okay? So, um, and that's been a problem in the relationship, but it will be no more after this because uh, whichever case this is, in this pause, this break, the wisdom needed for the next leg of the journey has been gained and they're coming forward with it. Now it's up to you to decide. And they're hoping, they're hoping that um, you're going to decide in their favor, of course. The sun speaks to endless possibilities here with this person. It speaks to the warmth being returned. Um, it is a yes answer to any question on your mind. It is very, very positive. I thank you for watching, for liking, and for sharing my videos and for subscribing. Also, thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation. Greatly appreciated. Many blessings to all of you.